Cassie and I have the pleasure of interviewing Dr. Michael Wald, who's been nicknamed the Blood Detective, for his keen ability to zero in on health problems and find natural solutions. And Dr. Wald, you also hold several degrees and certifications, right. including board certification in nutrition. Uh, we've been receiving emails today from people that have been sending things through to us, and our topic is the integration, the introduction rather, to integrated medicine. Okay. Okay, so Dr. Wall, for the people who are watching this video, please tell them what is so special about you and the rest of the staff here at Integrated Medicine at Monkey Screw. Well, um, first thing, Cassie, is uh, I'm the Director of Nutrition here at Integrated Medicine of Mount Kisco, so my primary role is to help design diets, lifestyle programs, and recommend, if needed, uh, vitamins, minerals, herbs, other types of nutritional supplements for various health problems, and I work with other practitioners here. As you know, we have uh, Dr. Neela Shaw, who's the Director of, of Medicine here, and also Mr. Sonny Seward, who's a, a Certified Clinical Nutritionist, and together we work in partnership in a concierge format to help people get results where they, when they may not have uh, gotten them before. So that leads me to this whole concierge concept. You know, we believe here that if people are going to get results, they need, uh, they need a, th to have our attention mm -hmm. and they need to have contact with us. So we give our cell phone numbers to our patients, as you know. They have our emails. So when questions and issues come up, we can very quickly uh, and effectively manage those issues rather than waiting you know, for the next consultation that may occur weeks after the next. Uh, always we want to minimize the amount of uh, in-person, out-of-pocket expenses. Uh, but the bottom line here is what makes integrated medicine so special is that we truly are integrated and holistic in our approach. We don't identify ourselves as a holistic practice because we also use medicine. And the combination of the best of Western and Eastern medicine is really our philosophy here. A person can choose to uh, do uh, medical you know, uh, types of therapies for their health issue, or they could not. So we feel that our obligation is to let them know what's available to them, and then we can develop a program. So it may be just medical, it may just be nutritional, or it may be an integrated approach. So best of both worlds. Yeah, best of both worlds, and uh, we are committed to making sure that people have an educated opinion and an educated choice. So here, we definitely find that's the truth, and already the clients that we see are already extremely highly educated. Many of them have already been to all manner of specialists before, and they haven't had a success with their health problems, or they've had mixed success and they'll come here and as you know uh, others will uh, make this their first choice because they just have always done things naturally and they would rather not uh, treat themselves just symptomatically through you know medications uh, and then yet others are open uh, to uh, new ideas and might again have a combination of things so in the context of this concierge approach, we get results a lot faster because we have that communication. I mean, you need to ask yourself, you know, how many of you out there have uh, the contact information of your practitioners to move your health forward when you have a question? I don't think so, many of them have cell numbers for the doctors. Yeah, so, so that alone is, uh, you know, a very, very special aspect mm. of what we do to enhance communication and uh, so that people know that we are there for them. And then uh, we use our patent pending uh, blood detective technology, which is a software program that I've designed and it's been in use now for over 10 years. And uh, that's where I got the uh, uh, the name Blood Detective, you know, from, uh, well, originally a patient was just very grateful that I helped them and said, you know, you're like a blood detective. And I took that name and I applied it to the software, uh, which is detecting hidden issues, which is basically a software program where I can put in the results of many, many different tests. And it helps us extrapolate out a person's needs. So this is unique. To, to our practice except for the certified blood detectives that I personally certified across the, the United States and abroad. There are just over a hundred different blood detectives, but I'm the original blood detective. Wonderful. And then uh, our approach too in this integrated setting uh, involves developing metabolic maps of individuals. So we might, if someone comes in, let's say, with a, a chronic fatigue issue, and they've you know been there, done that, and they're not getting help, we find that we have greater success when we can not only just measure their hormone levels, but also nutrient tests. And we might, might also consider the role of the gastrointestinal tract and malabsorption and other health problems that might 
end up as fatigue. We might, again, look at the hormones, we might check toxins. So multiple areas of healthcare that we look at at once, that integrated approach is very, very important. That's different than someone seeing different medical specialists in those fields that generally won't communicate with each other. And even when they do, they're communicating from a traditional medical perspective, which is fine. It's just not all that there is, certainly not all that we do. We have no issues referring to other types of medical professionals when needed and specialists, but oftentimes we find that answers to people's health problems are very apparent when you just do more thorough workups. So there's just testing and things that we would do that uh, the average individual would have a hard time convincing their practitioners to do. And even when their, their health providers are open to new things, like a patient last week said, yes, Dr. Wald, I mentioned vitamin D testing to my primary and he reluctantly did the test and it was low. And then I said, well, what did, you, what did the practitioner do for that? And she said, uh, he said to take vitamin D. I said, and how much? Oh, he didn't say. So there's the first problem right there. So we know if someone is clinically low in vitamin D, they need a pretty hefty amount, 50,000 units generally once or even twice a week for about a month and then we recheck. And so the point I'm trying to make here is that we just don't want to do the right tests out of context with practitioners who are well-meaning but don't know the topic. So in an integrated setting like this, we know nutrition, we know medicine, we know diet, we know exercise, lifestyle factors. We put that all together in this concierge format, and that's simply what we do. And we do allow uh, people to either call us up or to come in and schedule 15 minute no cost uh, consultations to see if this is the right place for them. We get to judge whether or not we are the best practitioners for those people that avail themselves of these consultations. And if not, again, we have no issues with helping them uh, find other practitioners or we decide to take them on. And then we really have a, a mutually agreeable um, relationship that tends to move things forward a lot faster. Now, within this practice here, are you willing to work with other practitioners? Yeah, that's as that's well? a great uh, thing to bring up because uh, I'd say every other pra every other patient that I see says that you know what about you know you speaking with my doctors? We're always happy to work with other practitioners as long as they're willing to work with us. Okay. So that's that's absolutely something that we're we're wanting to do. And getting the best of all worlds. There. That's right. And that's what there is great. to say about that.